Today is Monday, the 17th day of the month of June 2024. And uh, I am making this voice note 10 minutes past 7. On Monday, right in my bishop court. This is Bishop Daniel Tiambara from Fort Court. This voice note is directly directed to the defunct All Grand Pressure Group president, uh, popularly called German Machine, and his uh, defunct executive council. I want to go this way. Uh, when you don't know the actual meaning of a thing, abuse is inevitable. But when you understand a thing, the meaning of a thing, you will appreciate it. We have been able to see in the grand ecosystem in Nigeria the formation of all grand pressure group in the tenure of Comrade Kinsley, the Odogu himself. And that was a very wonderful administration. When they were to go to Abuja, to dialogue on Tepecom issue. Those of us who are still privileged to be alive, we vividly saw Comrade Kingsley shedding tears. He was not shedding tears because he was beaten. He was shedding tears because he was carrying the burdens of the masses he was carrying the burdens of the subscribers in nigeria that is a leader that is a president i remember vividly in the scripture how the high priest carried the apron of the 12 tribes of israel on his breastplate he makes petition for them and as he goes into the holies of holies he carries the burdens of Israel families individually into the presence of God that was a burden Kingsley carried and no wonder he was there into the hearts of Nigerians Nigerians so much love him because he has or he carries the heart of a leader. That was a hallmark of all Grand Pressure Group. And the members of all Grand Pressure Group at that time cut across the six geopolitical zones if not completely but they were working in harmony there was no betrayal among them there was no greed found in them they were carrying the burden of the masses to the grand handlers and grand handlers were afraid of them grand handlers were jittering anytime they hear all grand pressure group of Nigeria. We were also privileged to see the tenure of Comrade Newman. He popularly called himself the Buffalo himself. Newman, the Buffalo himself. The only thing that 
separate us in life is death. But if thou doest good, one day somebody will mention your name. It is on that note I am mentioning Comrade Newman. He also carried all Grand Pressure Group in a higher and glorious dimension. Now, we came down to a point where German machine took over. We have seen chapter one, Comrade Kingsley. We saw chapter two, Newman. This is chapter three in the person of German machine. I must say to Nigerians at this point in time, the, 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 the worst all grand pressure group is what we are experiencing now. The worst. We are completely experiencing the worst kind of all grand pressure group. All grand pressure group of Nigeria. If it were to be in a civilized country, German machine from Kogi State will quietly, without a word, bow out, tender his resignation, and he will go and rest honorably. But because of satanic and toxic demonic characters in man that is deposited in German machine he has refused to see the handwriting on the wall and he has continued to come out to the airspace because of the availability of data in his phone to confess to Nigerians to forgive him, forgive me, I take responsibility for this, I take responsibility for this again and again and again and again. With no remorse, with no repentance. The other day they came to the airspace to apologize to Nigerians and they said to us, the scene of the head should not be calculated to the scene of the heart. I don't understand what they meant by that. But be it as it may, we will not take the scene of the head to the scene of the heart. But day by day, as you stand in the airspace, as you come up to the airspace to confess your sins, the wickedness of man's heart is made open. I repeat, the wickedness of man's heart is made open. I listened to your, 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 your apology yesterday, your voice notes that you were taking responsibility as the president of whatever you called. But at the point, I listened to a point and I looked at it and I said, there's no remorseful. You're not remorseful for what you have done. Yes, German machine. You are not remorseful to what you have done. You are not remorseful to the enormous responsibility that is on you as a leader. Why the so-called noise, the so-called noise every day by your brother? Why the noise? I don't hate you people, though. but the act of all grand pressure group, this defunct act of all grand pressure is what I hate. I don't hate you. 
when you came to my hotel room in uh what do you call it in abuja when i was in abuja at the very first time me and you saw one-on-one -on -one, we sat together i looked at your face you two looked at my face yourself john and uh, felix amaputa i loved you i loved you people if i'm a father where's my honor where is my honor i have severally spoken to you people again and again advise you people again and again but what you are telling me is different from what you are doing what you are telling me is different from what you are doing if i'm a father to you where is my honor i repeat if i'm a father where is my honor You are taking responsibility of your weaknesses, but you are doing a different thing thereafter. You come to Nigerians, you open your mouth to say what you are telling Nigerians. At the back of your hand is a dagger. You are daggering the people. You want to go dagger the people. Is that a good leadership? Is that a good leadership, German machine? I want to ask you. That is not a good lead. I want to say to you, you are not brought up in a home of many years of godly living. Your heart is deceitful. Your heart is corny. You speak on both sides of your mouth. You are crafty. You are corny. You are wicked. There's wickedness in your heart. You could smile, but at your back is a is a dagger. That is not a good leader. That is not a good leader. Why is it that in your tenure, the wickedness of all grand pressure group is coming down? Why? So I think and I believe that it is time for you to throw in the towel and get out from that place. Because if you are called all grand pressure group of Nigeria, not all grand pressure group of Kogil, if you are called all grand pressure group of Nigeria, not Kogi, then you need to resign. All of you have failed. You have failed. You have failed Nigerians. Look at the number of persons that have died. And yet, you are not remorseful. You are not remorseful. Look at those on the sick bed. You are not remorseful. Look at the hunger that is going on on, land, on the land. Yet, you are not remorseful. Look at those sleeping under the tree. Living inside homes that are not covered by window. Not covered by door. Yet, you are not remorseful. Yet, one of you is saying that if this grant will remain till two, three years, will remain. You are satanic. You are no longer having the heart of a pastor. You are very satanic. You need to look for a church to go and do restitution. You are satanic. The Bible said the heart, the, the, the love of money is the root of, of, of all evil. Your heart has derailed from the love of God, from the compassionate nature from God's throne to men. You need to hide your face under the ground. Pour yourself ashes and ask God for forgiveness. Every one of you, whether your legs are broken, whether you are standing upright, go and ask God for mercy and grace. Your hearts are toxic. 
your heart are demonic your heart are satanic if we are nigerians must Kogi state dominate all ground pressure group no i repeat if we are nigerians must Kogi state dominate all ground pressure group and say they are nigerians we are nigerians we are not nigerians it is simply all greedy association of nigeria of uh, Kogi state all greedy association of Kogi state please enough is of enough enough is enough enough is enough i want to say to you under god today if you hear the sound of my voice let me say it to you from the throne of god i i say it to you from my heart you are heavens your heavens are closed your heavens are sealed with iron the water you drink from today shall not satisfy you the angel of the lord shall chase you confuse you and confound you in every slippery path you will fall because you have deceived the masses you have sent many to death in the missionary work of paul in the scripture alexander did much evil to apostle paul while apostle paul was preaching the gospel many were giving their life to christ they were coming into christ giving their life to christ restituting confessing their sins and baptizing for their remissions of sins alexander was craftily and cunningly going from house to house pulling down the hand of paul apostle paul because it's a copper smith the people are no longer patronizing him he was going against apostle paul well i meditate deep down in my heart i come to realize that the all grand greedy group of kogi state that is the place you have taken as alexander the copper smith in the scripture i want to pronounce to you today what paul told alexander the copper smith paul told him alexander the copper smith did me much evil the lord reward him the lord will reward you every time you make your voice note jama machine you said the lord knows every heart the lord that sees every heart that rewarded alexander the copper smith reward you individually all of you in that group in that defunct group let the lord reward you let the lord reward every evil that you have carried out that have, you have caused men to die let the, the lord reward you not only rewarding you he will reward your children children in the precious name of jesus it is very unfortunate very very unfortunate that you were living in times like this to see nigerians such heavenly blessing coming and you are standing on the way to stop it the lord 
is against you. The Lord is against you. You son of the devil, the Lord is against you. Until you repent. Your ways shall be slippery from today. Until you repent. When you are making your confession, let it come from the bowels of your heart. Not with corny and crafty language, without remorse in your heart. God rejects it. God hates it. Repent. Change your attitude. Change your attitude. Why are we suffering the manner in which we are suffering in chapter 3? Why? Why? Enough is enough. Rent your garment and rent your heart and the Lord will accept you to himself. I am not given this voice note to threaten any of you. I give this voice note in the sincerity of my heart to advise you all that you all turn in the towel and resigned you have failed the beneficiaries i repeat you have failed the beneficiaries after all we all came in as beneficiaries nobody is above all so you have failed and therefore from tonight declare that all grand pressure group of nigeria is vacant all the states of the federation please fill in good credible men and women with wisdom to occupy all grand pressure group of nigeria the one we have is closed the one we have they have failed us please all the states fill in people and then let's know who we are going to elect into the national level as all grand pressure group of nigeria that will represent the heart of the masses here i end my voice note thank you and god bless you this is bishop daniel t angbala i appreciate you all